Hello friends, my name is Viraj. Today I would like to show how to use Crystal Report Control in ASP.NET. First, I will create a database where I will show all my data in my database. So let us begin. So first click on your SQL Server. Your my SQL Server name is a dot. Uh, my server name is dot. Uh, and login is sa and my password just enter it and connect it so this the page is open now now click here on new query and create a database name database name youtube and just simply select this and execute it so my command is completed successfully now you can see here just click and select your database which you have created now just simply select it so my database name was youtube now start creating the table so write a query create table create a table nameless user just open and write whatever you want the data so I am required vid in int comma v name that is viewer name into the data types data type where care and location at which location in where care so I require this data type just select it now just select all and click on execute so there is some mistake in your parameters so oh, this was a mistake this was a silly mistake uh, okay I then select it and simply execute it so my command is completed successfully so for seeing that whatever the table you have created write a query select star from user and just simply select it and execute it see vid vname location VID has also created V name and location. So in this table, under the user table, all the rows and columns are created. So now just simply insert the data which you want to display. So write a query insert insert into user value. So one is my VID name is Reyes and location is Andheri and just simply select it and execute it so one row is affected if you want to see whatever the data we have inserted will be shown by using this query selection from user I simply execute it so you can see VID V name is Shreyash Andheri. So whatever data you have inserted, it is this thing here. Now write another, or you can insert two or three more data in it. So insert into user value Q Anil comma. other one more data you want to insert insert into user value comma paste honey one more 
into user value for comma by how just write the location that is navi by and just simply select all the three line and execute it the all the rows are affected go to the select star from user query select it and execute it you can see shreyas anil rupesh vaibhav and their location and there is other thane navi mumbai and their id so our data are stored in our database name youtube and the table name is the user so now let us go for making a crystal report so just minimize that and open your visual studio and this is my another visual studio that is visual studio 10 premium just go to the file new website and my website folder where well, got my folder name is website 1 where all my websites are stored just click here ok go to the solution right click add new item just click here so my web form name is a default.axpx just add it this is a coding part let's go to the design part here is our toolbox just select a crystal report viewer so we have selected here you can see this arrow just click here and choose the report so just click here and select new report source so the specify a uh, name for your crystal report source control so specify crystal report for crystal report source control just click here to select it go to the new report uh, just crea create a new crystal report now uh, specify the name to your report so just click it and so crystal report gallery so whatever the formula you wanted if you want to use an a report wizard or you want a report in the blank form for, uh, for designing it or for existing report you can choose anything just i will use the uh, using the uh, report wizard in standard format so click on ok it is my connection just click on your plus sign um, they will ask for server name that is the dot user id is given and my password just uh, just enter your password and select your database so i will select my database youtube where i have recently stored my all the data so go to the next and just finish it off wait for some time yeah youtube just click here go to dob and select user and just click on this arrow so this will be the selected table and go to the next uh, click here below it and choose your field to be display i want to display all the field so just click here go to the next again next next uh, available style i will i would like to select a drop table style and just finish it So this is my report this is my main report the you can preview my report it is looking like this go to the main report if you want to insert some uh, sort of an image go to the say, right click insert picture you can see a picture name of youtube just select it and open it and adjust it as per your requirement
and make some design, some adjustment, what you want to show in your report. Here also you insert another image in the name of YouTube. So you right click, insert, go to the picture, select YouTube and open it. And adjust the size. and just adjust it and just you can preview it so in this way your data will be display just go to the main report if you require a more uh, if you insert any sort of thing you can select a chart a line or box whatever section you require you can just use it now go to your default.axpx and just simply browse it so it is opening now so this is your report crystal report which we have created vid vname location the default date is taken by the system that is today's date 8-7-2017 and the, how it looks your uh, your simply report which you have created with your page number i have inserted an image of for up and down you can just print it it uh, any format uh, uh, according to the page from when so i just have a single page i will select and select all the page and simply export it to in pdf format let us see how it looks I just download it and I will open it so this is in the PDF format it is looking you can export it into other formats uh, there are files of one format like crystal PDF uh, Microsoft Excel whatever XML if you want to select a uh, Excel format they are available just simply use it and export it it will simply download just open it so this is your data simply whatever the data you have uh, stored in your database is simply displaying here so so in this way you can simply use the crystal report to display whatever data you have stored in your database so thanks for watching it hope you like it subscribe it share it give a love to my channel bye